Is your burner light staying on? I'm gonna show you how I fixed that problem. All right, my first order of business is to pull the range out and unplug it, then go behind the range and take off the back cover by removing all the screws around the perimeter. Now this range had the light stay on no matter what. If the burner was off, the burner was cold, it still had burner on, light lit. So it's gonna be a fix for that problem. So pull off the cover, it kind of lifts up. It's in like a channel at the bottom. So once that comes off, you can see the back. There's the light and it looks like it's a purple or violet wire that goes to each one of the range switches. So one of these switches needs to be replaced. You can see I plugged it back in. So I'm gonna be very careful and then unplug each purple light. So it went off for that one. So that one's probably the issue, but I'm gonna check this one also. So I'll unplug it. Okay, so that one, it stayed on. I'll trace the violet wire around and unplug that one so the light stayed on. And I'll unplug the last one and the light stayed on so that I can assume that it is the first one that I tried. So I'm going to unplug the range once again. I don't want to work on it while it's live. Go around to the front, pull off the knob, and then there'll be two screws holding the range switch in place. Now you can see these are really small screws. Doesn't take much to hold that on. So once I get the two screws out, I can give it a small tug from the back and push from the front. And here I have my range switch out. So here's the wiring setup of the range switch and I have the part number here. It's in the upper left-hand corner. So all I need to do now is unplug each wire, and I'm gonna do one wire at a time. Makes it easier to remember where the wires came from and where they need to go. Also, I have that picture that I took, but I just replace Take one wire off and replace it on the new range switch. And I picked that up online, reasonable price. Once I get all these plugged back in, I'm sure our light will be out when the burner is not on. Okay, so now I have all my wires in, make sure they're tight, and I'm gonna place it back in, make sure the two screw holes line up, and put the two mounting screws back in. And I'll put the knob back on, plug it in, and the burner light is now off so I see that was the problem let's go ahead and turn on the burner and see what happens let's just pick this one and the light goes on so I'll check this one the light goes on so it's operating the way it should next I'm gonna unplug the range while I put the back cover on I slide the back cover under the lip at the bottom and start replacing all the screws around the perimeter of the range. So if your burner light stays on, even if your range is off, this is the way you can fix that. If you like this video, make sure to subscribe. And for all the updates, hit that bell icon. I'm How To Bob, as always, thanks for watching.